I'd just like to thank everybody here coming today uh, to support uh, my efforts and the council efforts to try and keep George Bryant Centre open and the inpatient services here at Tamworth. Uh, currently at the minute there is a meeting going on with the leader, deputy leader and the chair of the health and wellbeing committee uh, with the trust uh, where the council is trying to put across their views on their disappointment that services will be staying in Stafford. Uh, but we're going to continue doing what we can to make sure these people's voices are heard uh, to keep the services here in Tamworth. I've, uh, I've used this service twice um, as an inpatient. Uh, when it first opened, um, I come down voluntarily. Secondly, um, I was actually sectioned. I was really ill. Um, I've got family in Tamworth. There's absolutely no way whatsoever I would have got better without my family and immediate friends visiting me. There's absolutely no way wife with children could have travelled all the way to Stafford. And that would actually make things worse. Now, you've actually closed down the Cherry Orchard house in Hospital Street. Since Edifice Hospital's closed, the General Hospital's closed, Everything's closing in Tamworth. We're right on the edge of the border. Tamworth is a massive growing area. Now you need to wake up, smell the coffee and invite us into your meetings. Not one of you has consulted anybody properly and professionally. You all attended a meeting way back before the fire and we held you accountable. Since then, you've been trying your level best to hit that balance sheet and make make it work and that's what all this is about there was a fire in this building the building wasn't being run properly the staff was understaffed it wasn't run properly now all these questions need to be answered so i would like you to invite everybody who has been in this hospital and then use these services to hear their voices properly and professionally and let's have a proper investigation of why you're closing this hospital thank you I'm here today to, to save this service. This service has helped so many people, including myself. Uh, and I just want to say, please do not close it down. It is, it's a necessary service, it's vital. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Please listen. The George Bryan Centre, along with the Margaret Stanhope Centre, Albert House, and a whole range of community facilities, uh, including um, Summerfield Crescent and various other community facilities were all created to replace the old Victorian hospital of St Matthew's in Burntwood when that closed down. Mm. This was a step forward. Now all of these facilities have gone and I must say I find it a little bit rich to find Conservative councillors saying that they want to preserve the George Bryan Centre when they've been in government for 12 years and all these other places I've mentioned have closed under their watch. Thank you. Health is about people, it's not about politics. Anyone of any colour of politics may sometimes need a hospital bed. They may sometimes be ill. If they're in Tamworth, they stand a chance of having mental illness. That is the second biggest mental illness in this area. Not in Stafford, but in Tamworth and Tartley Litchfield too. This hospital should be serving not just Tamworth, but a wider area. The same way that the Robert Peel Hospital was supposed to serve Litchfield, south side of Peninsula and Tamworth. In 1990, we were deemed big enough with a 60,000 population and household to have a full district general hospital. We didn't get it. Now that we have more like 97,000 households and you add on Litchfield's 54 and you add on South Sarsden and Codsall, how many households are now being deprived of this hospital? We want at least the mental health facility reinstated. It isn't as badly off as it was. It's just been left to decay in the hope that they can destroy it close it down close and shut it. We're not going to be shut up and neither is the George Bryan. Thank you. 
Yeah, I think it's absolutely essential and it's great to see so many people out here today that we fight as a community for the George Bryant Centre. It's excellent to see every political denomination of Tamworth movement here today actually standing together, fighting together to try and save what is an essential service to local people. Any NHS professional will tell you mental health is the poor relation towards physical health. They know more money needs invested in mental health. You improve people's mental health, you also improve their physical health. And it's the wrong step to close such an important centre that the people of Tamworth and the surrounding, surrounding areas so desperately need. And it's great to see so many people turn out today to voice their opposition and stand up for their democratic right and ask for the services they deserve. Thank you. Um, I've literally just come back from visiting my father-in-law over in St George's Hospital. Um, he was sectioned um, over two weeks ago. It's a real strain on the family uh, when we work to try and get over there to visit him. Uh, we're getting there a couple of times a week but we can see the deterioration in him already. We need something local. He literally only lives over the road but we're having to travel all that way to see him. He needs to see his family more. It's really hard and frustrating when you know this is only on your doorstep. We need to save it for the people of Tamworth. Yeah. 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 Yeah.